Murphy leading Werribee 5 2 32. Start of the final term here, match day live. And Bolton up against Lovell. Bolton goes up early. Lovell gets it down to the side of the pack. It's uh, been raining for the last 10 or so minutes as well, so pretty slippery out in the middle as, as well. A couple of fresh air shots. Nobody can get an effective ball away from the middle. You know, Tools put on a bit of a gang tackle. It's not going anywhere. The umpire will come in and bounce it down. Good tap too. Into the middle, into the glue pot. Kick off the ground. Primke gets across there. We're going to have a bit of soccer skills in the last oh, quarter, yeah. I think. He gets it across towards Johnson at the half back. He can't pick it up. And then he kicks it off the ground as well and sees it over. Yeah. Everywhere. So throw in. Primke gets it down. Dylan O'Toole runs onto it. Breaks free and handballs it inboard to Sponner. He goes to the left foot kick. And coming out, Williamson, who's up forward. Oh, thought about the handball, and then he did give it. It was a bit late, though, I think. And Werribee came back to pick to uh, pick his pocket. McNichol gets it across half back. Goes out wide. Monte Bruno takes the mark. He goes, oh, well, he's called to play on now because he has to get around. He does. He gets around Mawson. Goes to the right foot kick long towards uh, 50 out. Was that a push? Well, pushed him in the middle of the back. He certainly did. <laughs> and he, the umpire was standing right there, and uh, you're not going to get away from that. No, oh, that's a definite push in the back. Confay gets it away to Ricky O'Toole. Kick over the top. Oh, he's he, kicked it out in the full. Yeah. Call to play on now. Goes towards centre half. Four good kick to oh, Great kick. Magnificent. Great kick to McNichol. <clears throat> you mean that, you reckon? Oh, I think so. You, yeah. you see McNichol, he, he was just going into the space. It looked like a bit of a set play, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So Brad McNichol, who has kicked one behind today, this to make the margin six points. He will be kicking from 40 out, slight angle. Comes in now. Spotter standing the mark. Right foot kick oh, up high. And. Oh, it's come back. It. I think it he's got it. Come back. And he's put it through. Four minutes in the quarter. The umpire puts it in the air. Up high bolt, and I'll tell you what, Lovell did a fantastic job, I reckon, in the third quarter in the ruck, and he's doing well in the last quarter. But the clearance has come out to uh, Marsh on centre wing for East. Player come in from the side there, play on, said the umpire. There's uh, terrific work by the, the defence for the Werribee side, looking for Weatherly, can't take the mark. W uh, Williamson, he's tackled, drops a footy. No, in the back, holding the man, whatever you want. So, free kick East Geelong. It's gone to Williamson. Phipps standing the mark. No quarter given here. Williamson now. Called to uh, play on by the umpire. Goes towards the uh, the wing. Lovell is in there along with uh, a number of others, including Patterson. Ball comes out. The... Uh, well, there's quite a bit of... Catch <laughs> in the backs, too. Up high... Bolton can't get the footy clear. Ricky O'Toole now. Yeah, that's fair enough. You don't want him to start no, now. No, has uh, Bolton and Lovell. Lovell got the best of that. Ball comes out clear. Picked up by Ricky O'Toole. Conditions like this will absolutely suit him as the ball goes towards the uh, full forward position for East. But uh, Werribee working hard. McKnight can't get a handball clear, can't get the ball clear. Gee, it is hard, rough and tough in the pack there as the ball comes out to Chalice. He's a bloke that could break it open. Open goal, goes goalward, not a soul back there. How important might that behind be? Off the boot of uh, Chalice, his first score for the day. Won't matter. 5-15-45 East, 6-2-38 Werribee. Smith's holding Blood Suzuki final quarter scoreboard. Six minutes gone. Won't matter to East because a draw will leave them in third position in the double chance. A kick so. in from Knight. <clears throat> a bad you throw in. Lovell, Bolton, over the back. King gets it down. Montebruno, Ooh. kick off the ground. Goes towards Kutsamanis. Fernandez against him as well. Kutsamanis kept his feet. But then Fernandez had some uh, support in Marsh. Right foot tumbling punt towards centre half forward. Oh, good, good mark. mark. A very good mark by Bridie. In the conditions, that Absolutely. was a beauty. <clears throat> so Bridie has got the footy. Left foot kick goes long towards centre wing. Looking for Kutsamanis. Fernandez against him. Bray. Handball outboard to Patterson. His kick was partly smothered. King to run onto it. Coming the other way, Phipps. Close to the boundary line. Tried to handball it back in. Johnson used the body. King against him. Falls into the arms of Phipps. Gets the kick around the corner towards half forward. In front, Williamson to run onto it. They do well, Werribee, who keep it in play. Dragged He's in. Staged. Now Sponner, left foot kick. Back towards centre wing. 
Through the number of hands coming out, Lachlan Sponner. He gets it marched front and centre. Handball chopped off though. Bridie, left foot kick around the corner. Towards centre half for Jones at back behind. Can't take the mark. Mawson's there fighting hard for it. Handball back in ball to Ricky O'Toole. He's got it at centre half back. He gets a shepherd from Bolton. He goes with the right foot kick now towards half forward. Lachlan Sponner made his way up from the opposite side centre wing position. If it sits for him, he's in. He's 50 out from goal. He comes back around on the right. Short little kick towards oh. Chalice. Can't take the mark. Play on. He still gets it. He can get it back inboard to Marsh, but he loses the ball in the tackle, and the Centurions might be able to break free. They go towards Lovell and also Blushkey. Blushkey takes the mark inside defensive 50. Chips the ball to Patterson under pressure. Takes the mark. Johnson standing the mark. Still at half back. He chips the ball over the head of Bray. Oh, They've turned it over. That's a bad one. And now Jesse Mawson's got it in the middle. So Mawson now chips it for inside oh, 50. Geez. Lovell still at his ground. Takes a strong mark. Sent half back for Werribee. Chips it. Finds Blushkey again. Now can he do any better this time? Need to go the long kick. Does just that. Towards centre wing. One on three. Oh, almost a fantastic mark there to... Uh, is that Weatherly under there? I think it might be. So, ball up. Tap oh. forward. Nobody there to get it for Werribee. Sponner takes it. Got it clear. A nice little throw there from Werribee. Goes towards the uh, centre wing. Oh, great chest mark. And uh, put the body up high and got that behind it, Williamson. And has taken the mark. Williamson now. Chips it. Uh, Johnson, standing alone. Goes goalwards. to long, long, long kick. It's going to land... In fact, it's uh, through the goal. Brilliant kick there from Johnson. In the there. middle, Bolton goes up early. Lovell gets it down. Here is Marsh. Falls over. Weatherly can't take it with him. Sponner. Bray through the middle. Leaves the ball behind, though. And neither team can really get an effective possession out of the uh, glue pot that is the <laughs> middle here at Galvin Park. Ricky Bolton. Lovell gets it down. Primke at the back of the pack. Handball towards Johnson. Blushkey got a push in the back. We'll and lateral kick. Bridie. They go on the hurry, Grubby, don't yeah, they? They do. Bridie. Oh, oh, kick was smothered by Bolton. Did well. Bridie over the top of it again. Ball comes back. And they break free. They get a little kick around the corner. Might be all right to Patterson, who just takes the mark under pressure. Right half forward flank for Werribee. Goes towards the leader. Jones has a great kick. And Jones takes the mark. 40 out from goal. Slight angle. Got to kick the goal, Jase, doesn't he? He does. He does. And he uh, he hasn't troubled the scorers to date. 13 points of difference at the moment. And Phil Jones has the ball. It's only three-quarter time at the moment at Winch. So it's going to be a late one. Winch 13-9, West 7-5. All over. Kick by Jones. Pretty good off the boot. And I think he split the middle. He has. Seven points of difference. John, uh, up high, Bolton got the tap down. Lovell at ground level. Picks it up. Can't get a kick away. Kick off the ground. Smothered. Oh, pushing the back to Werribee player. Surely he was on the bottom of the pack there. Well, common sense umpire and brought it out of the mud patch. Lovell again. Gets the tap down. Johnson, fresh air shot. Ball under a heap of players. Finally comes out. Umpire said, I'll have it in the meantime. It's the last man up off the deck on that occasion was in fact Lovell up high over the top was uh, Bolton player tried to weave his way through there no chance in the wide world O'Toole threw it out kick off the ground for Werribee Centrals gets it uh, going slightly forward gee it's hard and tough in there Lovell picked it up long handball forward Phipps kick off the ground forward for Werribee Centrals now who's the quickest to run onto it as the, the ball at full forward Mota Bruno threw himself forward looking for a free kick wasn't there East Geelong trying to uh, crash their way clear as uh, Werribee Central's players. Gee, there's a big pack of players. Player hell without the footy, surely. Ricky O'Toole, in fact, but he... <coughs> so a ball up from the ruck contest. Only 40 out from the Werribee goal. King over the top of it. He tries to break free. Can't do so. Ball spills free to the side of the pack. And... The umpire might... I don't he still reckons Cullen can't umpire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the ball... Comes to the side of the pack. Eagles over the top of it. And uh, 25 out directly in front. This to make the margin a point. So Luke Phipps. He'll probably get up and about if he kicks this grub. He might, yeah. <laughs> he comes in. 25 out. 
Right foot kick, stabs at it, kick kicks it. the goal. So he kicks his first. So ball in the air once again. Love all again, gets the tap down. Bray can't control it. Picked up and uh, kicked forward for uh, Werribee Centrals. Phipps again. He's a man possessed at the moment, playing up forward. Flipped out, kick comes for East Geelong. Rick O'Toole's under it, takes the mark comfortably. Hooks it around the body, looking for and finding uh, Mawson. Mawson there, around the body. Chalice, he gets pushed out of the contest far too easily. Umpire Lovell and uh, Bolt. Bolt gets the tap on that occasion. Patterson, first back to the footy. For Werribee Centrals, kicks toward the mud patch. Almost a diving mark. Primke picks it up back of the pack. Long handball to Johnson, round the corner. Kicks it. Oh, there's a player absolutely on his own. Jesse Mawson. How does that happen? Handball over the top to uh, his brother. And his brother, Jake, strolls into the open goal and kick. Up against Lovell. Bolton goes up and gets it down. Pushes it forward. But getting back there, Monte Bruno. Right foot kick to centre wing. Marsh to run onto it. Gets a foot to it, but doesn't uh, stop Patterson to run onto it as well. Johnson comes across. They see it. Damn, you throw in. Bolton gets it down. Lovell gets a second tap at it, though. Through a chain of hands. Threw it. Lovell threw it out. Literally threw it. Spotter, though. The other way. Handball to Ricky O'Toole. Little left foot kick around the corner towards Jake Mawson. He just goes a left foot kick towards half forward. Push it forward at all costs. He goes there. Knight comes the other way. Wrapped up. Holding the ball. Oh, where's the punts? There it is. Oh, half a punts from Greg Cullen. Yeah, he's too old yeah. to get right down. That's a problem. <laughs> What's he got the hat on for? It's not 44 degrees. <laughs> So oh, free kick. That's nearly 50. Car surely. goes along to the square. Over the back. Oh, that's a push too. Yes, yeah, he's is. made that one. Oh, come on, Mick. <laughs> Gee whiz. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the blind man could have seen the push from Chalice. <laughs> so. Hey, what, Grubby? The, the rain stopped the wind a bit, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it has. And that's what I alluded to at three-quarter time. Oh, Bolton goes up. Puts a hand up. That could have been high too. But Patterson goes with the torpedo punt towards the... Uh, Boundary line. <laughs> so the ball in from the boundary umpire, just forward of centre for the Werribee side. Lovell taps the back. Bray can't run it. Monte Bruno can't pick it up. A little kick out of the pack goes forward. Diving mark for East Geelong. Great work there. They can push back now, Eric, because they don't have to kick another goal to win this now, you wouldn't think. Yes, you're right. So chip it out wide. Ricky O'Toole, pass master at this sort of... Uh, Control the footy, so he just chips it forward. Play. He never went forward and he never went back. You can't sit in the middle, mate. So Cameron. You can in the twos, though. <laughs> Cameron Next there one. for East Geelong. Oh, <laughs> dangerous. Goes to the corridor, but uh, Bolton's there. Oh, 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 oh lucky he won the bucket of sugar. It would have splattered <laughs> all over him. <laughs> so uh, uh, it might be crucial. Umpire. Oh, whistle. pay it's... advantage. <laughs> Power off. So, <laughs> Free kick for Monte Bruno for Werribee Central's the big torpedo. Oh, oh, I tell you what, you didn't like him in the back line in the third quarter, but that's where he's got to be now, oh, Eric. You're dead right. Goes to his brother. He goes out wide to Johnson. Johnson there along the uh, boundary. Oh, Mawson runs onto the foot. He can run into the open goal. In fact, he's a uh, good team play. Went to Carr. Should have had a shot. He should have had the shot. Carr was screaming for it, but the kick was too high. So the ball now, Werribee Central's the opportunity to bring it at Cornish. Takes the mark. Now he's got Patterson free. Where's he going to go? He's got to go, go to that way, surely. Patterson there takes the mark. Got to keep going with it. Goes the long kick along the boundary. Three to one. Look at that. East Geelong. Weatherly almost uh, did the impossible. Johnson, where the ball's on the deck. Picks it up. Round the body. Kicks it towards half forward. Sponner again. Bloody great game. Sponner picks it up. Handball's clear, Lovell, hit met by Bolton. Gee, they're, they're working hard both sides here at uh, around about half forward for the East Geelong side. Picked up Sponner again, the goal's open. The ball's running, running, running. Oh, oh Just to the left-hand side, uh, behind to uh, Sponner. I reckon they're home. Seven goals, 16. I think you're right. I just think they're playing well enough now to be home. 58 East. 8-2. Oh, they can when they Central. turn it over Smith too. Holden, Blood Suzuki, final quarter scoreboard. Knight turned it over to Jesse Mawson. Out from play. Dylan O'Toole to run in 10 metres out and kicks the goal. That is the ball game. Dylan O'Toole kicks his first bat. The players will be more than happy to get off the uh, the ground. It is pouring rain. 
Tap down came from Lovell to Phipps. Kick off the ground. Handball back to Phipps who followed up. Goes long towards full forward. Pack of players back there, Mark. Would have been difficult in the field, don't boy. Don't have to worry about that, son. Get it in. The ball's in. Big pack of play east through uh, Williamson. Goes towards uh, the boundary. Confay picks it up to uh, Johnson. Takes the mark. Just backward of centre. Decides to play on. He's got uh, Chalice running forward. Oh, Chalice copped it. He ran into it. I think it was a shoulder. He ran into it anyway, but uh, Werribee Central's the turnover's got the ball back to uh, half forward. And uh, Mark taken by uh, Fernandez, is it back no, there? No, Marsh. Marsh, is it? Hard to see as they, uh, he chips it inboard. Mark taken again. So East uh, just defending now through Williamson. Will go wide. Marsh has uh, gone wide, and that's where he's gone. Deep to the back pocket. Decides to play on. Had a player leading out there, but he's gone for the safety of the boundary. Primke was heading toward. Got there wrong again on the board, so I won't tell you what the scoreboard reads. But we have ticked past 25, almost 26 minutes. I think it might be all over for uh, Werribee as Ricky O'Toole, the saving mark once again, goes towards centre wing. Chalice takes the mark, decides to go. Kicks it uh, along the boundary to Sponner, who's also on his own. As Grubby said, it's all out attack for... Uh, the Werribee side, and uh, consequently there are players loose everywhere. However, ball picked up for Werribee Central. is kicked towards centre wing. A race for the footy. Good work, uh, Confay, but he's got four to beat. Can't do that. The numbers uh, went out, and it's picked up by Salmon for uh, Werribee Central's. Back towards full forward. Mota Bruno, can he control? 40 around from the Werribee goal. Jones gets there first. Bashes it towards the goal square. Ricky O'Toole back there is the goalkeeper. Just chips the ball over the top to Kane Marsh. Can run onto it in the back pocket. He chips it over the top. Crowded the loose man. Bolton takes the mark. Outside defensive 50. Oh, Spawner, look. Yeah. He gets to him now. Well, it's sit for him, though. Cornish comes the other way. Tried to tap it on. Didn't work for him. He went back and got it himself. And then he gets wrapped up. Drops the footy. King, he leaves it, he tries to tap it back, he does, gives it to Phipps, he goes towards half forward, it's okay. Montebruno takes the mark. Left half forward. Goes towards the lead of his brother. Oh, at the back. Oh, oh geez. geez. Pretty ordinary tackle. <laughs> By Kutsamanis. And Cody Watson will take the free kick. Happy to hold up the play too with the uh, 27 and a half minutes gone on the clock. He Eight goes, goals in front, Winch at Winch. Goes with the right foot, kick towards centre wing. Over the back of the pack, Jones is there, Phipps as well. And Primke keeps his seat over the boundary line. Here's yeah, somebody outside the broadcast box, they blow the siren. I think they'd be pretty happy. <laughs> Players in particular, very, very dark. Now there's a, uh, a free kick, a ruck infringement, I'd suggest, because... Uh, it's gone to Bolton. Long kick along the line for Bolton towards half forward for East Geelong. Off hands, it's gone to win like, particularly the last half. As the umpire puts it in once again. Up high was Bolton. Taps it toward the front, toward the boundary, and in fact over again. Boy brings it in once again. Bolton and Lovell contest it once again. A little bit uh, towards the East Geelong goals, but picked up uh, Werribee Central's chipped in board. Mark Taken Patterson. Goes backwards, looking for 50, not there. Now decide, well, he's called to play on. Has to kick it to the middle of the ground. Cameron, in position, can't take the mark at ground level. Certainly East have been uh, quite dominant in this final quarter as the ball again. Well, their back line's been terrific. Werribee's had most of the play. Yes, their Confay, back line's been Confay great. out wide. Terrific work there. Stewart can't pick it up. Does, gets a handball clear. There's another whistle on play. It's behind the ground. That's, that's fair enough. Chip Johnson in front of our broadcast position. Nobody manning the mark. Now they do. I tell you what, he's hurt him too. He's hurt his shoulder or his arm. So Johnson there. Long kick towards uh, half forward. Backing back there was uh, Phipps. Can't take the mark. Finally uh, picked up. Kicked along the, the boundary. He's still, oh, Bolton can, can hardly raise a gallop. He comes back. He's going to get a, uh, a possession anyway. Thrown to the ground without the footy. Ricky O'Toole's in there. They're just bottling it just over the boundary line. Will suit East. 
as we tick to 30 minutes in the uh, final quarter. I think we can ring it, can't we? 8-16 plays, 8-2, Eastern Control. There's a statistic uh, timekeeper up there, though, Grubby. <laughs> Lovell gets it down to the side of the pack, Montebruno. Chalice wrapped up, close to the boundary line. Oh! Yeah, no, I think it was out first. I think he made the right decision. Settle down, Rick. Settle down. Settle down. Throw it in. <laughs> minute to go. Minute to go. There you go. Minute to go, Grub. Yeah. Free kick, rat that, bone. That, that is very poor umpiring. What was that for? Because Monte well, Bruno watching. punched him in the stomach and he didn't report him. He just gave a free kick. That's poor umpiring. So the ball has gone forward towards Julian Carr and he's got the ball 50 out from goal. And it would be an absolutely amazing kick if he could kick a goal from here. He's got the wind and the rain and the breeze behind him, though, to the side. If he just uh, aims at middle of the... Behind post Pace. grub, you watch this. Who cares? Watch this. <laughs> over. Watch this. Watch this. Yeah, you're right, grub, it watch is. this. Watch this. <laughs> he's done it. <laughs> oh, I think he's kicked the goal. <laughs> oh, come on, I forgot. <laughs> he can't see it. He wouldn't know. <laughs> he's it's kicked a goal. The goal. <laughs> I told you. <ya. laughs> Julian Carr kicks his first. And the ninth.